delete an activity or a grouping in the execution time schedule. And also delete the activity or the grouping from the project time schedule. Modify the expected activity quantity in the execution time schedule. And obtain the same quantity also modified in the project. Assign the master resource to an activity in the execution time schedule. and obtain the same assignment in the project. Insert the new activities and folders in the execution time schedule. Notice that these will also be added in the project time schedule. In execution time schedule, You'll see these modifications in project time schedule.